good morning to all my friends and family. Just pulled an all-nighter at my full-time job. Had a little overtime, so just got off at 6.50 in the morning. And uh, I'm going to go do some detecting. I'm meeting up with Tennessee Gem today. I'm going to meet him over there about 9-ish. So we're going to try to get a good video today. And, uh, yeah, we're going to try to find some good stuff. So I'm kind of tired. Uh, had to stop by, put some gas in my vehicle. Going to grab some coffee and breakfast. So hoping to find something good today. So as soon as we get the first treasure of the day, I will see you then. See you in a little bit. I'm so I'm hitting the playground first before I go out and uh, actually do some detecting in the grass, but just got my first signal today. It looks like I got uh, some type of earring. It was ringing up in the low numbers, but just a junk earring or, I don't know, it might go to a necklace. So, alrighty, I'll see you here in the next find. All right, so I was getting a pretty deep signal right now, and it was showing up as a high number, way up in the 20s. But I dug this right now, and I see a little patina in the plug. Not really sure what it is. Let's see what we got here. I don't know if it's like a button or something. Because on the back, it looks like it has some type of thing on there. So we'll try to clean it up and see if it's anything of interest, but uh, okie dokie. See you here on the next one. So just got another strong signal right now. This one is ringing up about 11, and right here on the pole looks like something really shiny. Uh, let's see what we got here. Hmm. What does it say? It says, I can flip it around, there it goes, 25 years of service, it's like a pin or some, A-C-O-A, -A. not sure what that is, but it's got like a little thing in the back of it, I'll have to clean it up and then see what we have, it says, uh, huh, Looks like it says RFW 1011 of 64. So I'm imagining that's 1964, so pretty unique. I'll clean it up and then uh, see you guys here in the next one. All right guys, so pretty excited about my recent find. Just cleaned it up. We're gonna bring it. Wait, who's that? It looks like Tennessee Jam to me. Oh, run, run. <laughs> <laughs> so this is what I just found. I cleaned it up and I'm pretty sure it's gold. But take a look at that. Look at the back of it. Oh, wow. It's got like stamps on it if you look under there. Yeah. It's got like, it says like 10 carat, 14 carat. You can see in the small print down there at the bottom. Yeah. It looks like gold though. Let's get this. Uh, Let's see what Tennessee Jam thinks about this. Get this loop out of here and see what we can come up with. So we're going to come out here and hunt today. We've been to this place a long time ago. So far I'm doing pretty good, but uh, pretty sure that's gold. This is the property of Tennessee Gym. That's what it says. That's exactly what it says. <laughs> <laughs> no, it says uh, 14K on there. Huh. So gold to start off with, huh? That's good. It's got RFW on 101164. Why don't you show everybody what the front of it looks like since I cleaned it up? Looks like, uh, let's see, how, take a look at it. So that's better. It says Alcoa, 25 years of service. And can you flip it around for everybody to see? And on the back, it's got, like, stamps on it, but it's got, like, a date, and then you can see where it has, like, the LG 10 karat, 14 karat. Huh. It definitely got to be gold. Yeah. Looks like it. So, all right, guys. Well, let's go find some more stuff and see just here. see you yeah, here in a little bit. Here. All right, guys. It's got another good signal on this hole. It's ringing up in the high 20s. Not sure what it is. Let's see what we got here. Hmm. if it's some type of pin or what it is but yeah it goes on some it looks like it's got a pin on the back it clips onto a shirt or some maybe it's boy cub scouts maybe i see a cs so that's kind of neat i'll clean it up and then uh, we'll take a look at it here in a little bit so all right we'll see you on the next one all right just got a deep signal over here uh looks like a buckle maybe 
Probably modern, but these bugs keep flying all over my neck, starting to get annoying. <laughs> there you go, right there. See, pretty neat. All right, see you here in the next video. Cool. Hey everybody, so uh, Tennessee Jam just got himself a Merc. He's over here recording it. Uh, Spray this bad boy up here. Tell you what, I don't have my glasses on. Can you? Let's see if we can identify what type of Merc. Uh, looks to me, it looks like it says 1917 on it. Really? Yeah, 1917. Oh, cool. Good job. There's a mint mark on it. Oh, that's interesting. Huh? Oh, shoot. My damn camera quit. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, congrats to Tennessee Jim. We got a 1917 Mercury Dime. So on to the next video. See yeah, you in a bit. This is interesting. It's got... So it's got another good signal, and it looks like I got myself a spoon. Not sure what the age is on this, but it's broken. Just wondering if it was silver or not. Probably not. Maybe... I don't know. I can't really tell by spoons, but already see you here in a little bit. All right, guys, just got a good signal over here. This one's about maybe two to three inches down the plug, but about a 11 or 12 is ringing up as. And it looks like I got an earring of some sort. I'm not sure what type it is. Uh, pretty looking. I don't know if it's junk or what it is. It could be uh, plated or... I'm gonna have to clean it up and see what we got, but uh, really pretty. It's got some like diamond looking things on it. So I'll get those checked out and uh, I'll let you know if I find anything on it. All right, see you here in a little bit. So Jim doesn't know that I'm gonna kick a soccer ball towards him. Let's see this guys. Woo! Kick it back. I'm recording you. <laughs> there he goes. Dude! <laughs> Go! Alrighty guys, so here is the end of my day. As you can see, my trash pile was a lot again. Uh, did a lot of digging, but it was worth all the good finds I got today. A uh, decent amount of coins, no quarters or anything today. And then my best finds that I got was a button, a piece of a spoon, got a buckle. I got, it looks like either an earring or it goes to a necklace. And then I found that one a little while ago. It's, it looks like it's gold plated. And then I found this, it's a Girl Scout. It's like a pin, it's got the pin on the back. And then this one was probably my best find of the day. It says uh, Alcoa, I can hold my hand. Let me turn around real fast, give me a second. It says Alcoa, 25 years of service. And then when you flip it back, it says RFW 1011 to 64. And then the bottom says LGB 10 carat and 14 carat. So definitely gold. And then also had this flat button right here. Not sure what it is. It's got some lettering and stuff on it. So I'm going to clean it up and see what I can get out of it. So pretty good day, guys. So let's go check out Tennessee Jim and see what he found today. So show us what you got there, Tennessee Jim. Nah, I don't get as much trash as you do. <laughs> you dig You dig for trash. I just don't dig for that. I'm, I'm not into that. <laughs> <laughs> but that's my trash. I got my cancel on. I'm thinking this is some sort of bail, part of a bail maybe. Oh, it looks know. like it, yeah. Uh, then pull tabs and stuff like that. And then you're good for And somebody found this for me and gave it to me. Oh, that's very nice of them. <laughs> got a butterfly and looks like you got a little fire engine. Yeah, surface fine. And, and then your best finds it. of the day. Best finds, well, plaid coins. And then I got a 1945 and 1943 Mercury Dime, 1945 uh, Washington Quarter. This was a coin spell, putting them together. And then this one's 101 years old. It's a 1917. Uh, mercury dime and on the back it's got a little arrow on it that's pretty neat and uh, good. congrats on your finds today yeah thank you so already guys so we'll see you in the next video and we'll catch you later everybody